Great trees on the waterfront. Just a few of the flowers blooming this time of the year. And of course, it means a lot of pollen in the air. And allergies. <laughs> Yeah, well, another the, yeah. allergy in sufferer, Pat yes. Doris, wow. who works in the newsroom, I had a chance to check out some natural remedies for those symptoms. Oh, they're gorgeous. They should be even better in a few days. Along Portland's waterfront, the blooming trees attract lots of photographers and lots of people who can feel that allergy season is here. Itchy nose watery eyes. Specifically to me, I just, I get a headache, I feel a little groggy, and it's just congestion. Watery eyes, kind of like runny nose, lots of sneezing. Um, yeah, and especially when I wake up in the morning, that's when it's worse, when it's been sunny like this. Some of us just endure. <coughs> Honestly, in a lot of ways, I, I'm a guy, so I don't actually go to the doctor or take pills or do anything, so I just grin and bear it and wrestle through it. That's about really my remedy. But it doesn't have to be that way. So to really get to the bottom line of why you have allergies, we have to take a look at the gut. Dr. Uh, Suzanne yeah. Breen is a naturopath also, in downtown Portland. She said sometimes allergies result from your adrenal glands working too little or too much. Testing can help figure that out. But in the meantime, she recommends an ancient solution, the neti pot. We need to keep our nasal passages clear and we have wonderful recipes um, for neti pots. If you're not used to using a neti pot, get used to using a neti pot because it's amazing. This YouTube video shows how they're used. They date back as far as 5,000 years to India. The kind of electromagnetic frequency that runs through the body. And Others turn to acupuncture. To Ellen Goldsmith says it does work. That when people are stressed and tired, it has a, a huge impact on the immune system. So from an acupuncture point of view, we'll seek to, what we say is, increase and support and boost the chi so that the body is strong enough to kind of ward off those allergens that are outside. So there you go. We face spring allergies every year. Maybe this will be your year to do something about them so that when you see the trees blooming next year, you can feel the joy of a new season, not the pain of allergy symptoms. Oh. Well, Rod, maybe the forecast yeah. will help us out the next couple days. Well, one of the